Did I use enough? Hell no! Really? Hell, Hell no! I want to show you guys how much product she wants me to use. Like half the bottle. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here in my new house. Come on in, house tour, let's go. Just kidding, this house is $3 million over my budget. Today I'm here because every time I do a video with my curly hair, you guys just really, really love it. I feel like I've honestly found my curly hair like refuge in YouTube videos. Why not keep contributing to the curly haired YouTube community? They were there for me when I needed them. Today I'm here with the number one curly girl, my curly haired inspiration for freaking life, Jenna. Romance! <laughs> Not only is her hair amazing, but she's Aww. just an amazing person. I'm so proud of her hair journey because Thank it's you. come such a long way. People don't realize how much maintenance curls it require. It is so much maintenance. I remember when I first met you, you're like, don't go blonde. And I went blonde. I was like, I need to be Jenna. Today we are going to be switching curly hair routines. I honestly like have no idea how this is going to turn out. Me either. <laughs> it could be really good, or it could just leave us both looking really, real raggedy. You have to like create a potion that fits your Yo, hair. We're gonna get inside. I brought all my curly hair products. I asked you to bring all yours too. We are gonna swap our curly hair routines. You guys are gonna see, and us as well, if we still look good. Hopefully you guys can learn some cool new products. And if you're not curly, you can just sit back and learn the struggle. And appreciate and respect the struggle. Let's get started. We're just eating some pretzels. Mm. First of all, can we just point out your hair looks great? Jeez, it's like day five. We're supposed to come with nothing in our hair. She didn't tell me that. You wanna see this? She didn't tell me any of this, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna stick my head in the sink and then start fresh. Oh, wait. <laughs> this is my natural hair. We're gonna hope that this looks better in a quick, hot minute. What is the first product you start with? Right out of the shower, while it's like soaking wet, I just like drain the water out. I always start with Miss Jessie's Pillow Soft Curl. And I'll put it here first, and then I'll come through. Will you put it up here? A little bit, yeah, a little bit. Maybe that's what I've been doing. Everybody's hair is different. I just put a little bit. I try not to put too much though, because it weighs it down. And then I wrap in either a towel or like a t-shirt. You wrap it? Yeah. To do like the plopping or? Just so it's not so wet. So I just put it, I just leave it in the t-shirt and then I'll like walk around for 30 minutes or like do my makeup. What? And then I'll diffuse it and I'll put like mousse in it and then I'll diffuse it. Okay. I guess I'm gonna start doing your hair routine. Okay. Oh, you're already starting. I got Can I it. Let mine first? Yeah, girl. So you need to get ugly. Jenna's currently in the kitchen <laughs> sink, wetting her hair. I am currently spraying with my spray bottle. Oh God. I'm wet and then I'm out of the shower. I'm Jenna. I'm gonna take the pillow soft curls. And oh, and I use this brush. You're gonna have to use this brush. Wait, how much do you use? Is this good? Probably. Okay. Y'all, I'm about to use half this bottle on my hair. How do you like apply this? Do you section it or like what's the... Sometimes. You've never used a Denman brush before, right? No, I just bought it and it confuses me. you have me. it with you? Yeah. Wait, so you detangle with the Denman? Yes, so you're supposed to brush this way when you detangle and then you wanna style it, you're supposed to use it the other way. I'm using so much of this product. Oh wait, you put it up here. A little bit, yeah. See, your hair is more dry than mine would be. Cause like, I would only do it like straight out of the shower. Mm -hmm. What type of hair would you describe your hair? I don't know those number letter combos. Yeah, I don't know either. People are always like, I have 3B hair. What do you think I should? I'm like, I have no idea what that means. How do you do your product? Okay. So is your hair dripping wet when you put it in or not? Not dripping wet, but so like my hair damp. No, your hair's perfect. First thing I do is I get out of the shower and then I've been using it to 10 leave-in conditioner. So how much of this do I? I? I usually do like seven sprays and then I, I do like the edges is that enough? a little oh. bit I do it up that's oh edges roots. oh wait no <laughs> I do that and then like I'll brush it through okay. with like a comb. Oh, a comb I brought you my comb I'm gonna make this more wet because you make it really wet, wet. <gasps> this doesn't feel safe just have to be careful. how much product do you put in do you put product right away next or okay. do you wait a little bit yeah I put it all in at the same time I will go in next with a different one. this bitch right here Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Leave-In Conditioner I love this but I feel like I can't style my hair if I use it really yeah I feel like I have to just keep it in a bun why it's too much I think it makes it stringy I don't maybe it will I'm interested to see this I so use a of lot this? of this like I've only used it once and that's how it looks no what? Girl, look at my hair! Like that? 
That's like enough for like one piece of hair. Just keep digging in there, you know? Do you like it big or do you like it more like compact? I like it more compact because okay. then I pull them apart after I diffuse and then it gets it nice and big. Did I use enough? Hell no! Really? Oh Hell God. no! Like I use like and then I like I want to show you guys how much product she wants me to use. Like half the bottle. Look at how much already. Oh my god. Just comes out. My hair would be like soaking it all up. I've detangled with the Deadman and I've done the pillow sauce. No, no, no. So before you do that, you have to do the Deadman the proper way now. Whoa. Little section. Oh, no, no, no. So I go like this. Go inward. And then I just kind of scrunch it and then I keep going through the whole head. Because oh. you'll literally see the curl. Oh my gosh. That looks so good. I mean, yeah, I can see it from here. Yeah, you'll see it form. How should we do that? So you put more different products before we start these? My so, hair feels so heavy. Sometimes I will put the jelly soft, but lately... <laughs> I've been putting... <laughs> <laughs> I think she's setting me up. No! So how much of this do you use? I mean, look at it. <laughs> you can use as much as you want. I haven't used gel since I was like a teenager. Are I you think... calling me young? No, that's just all I could afford was Seriously. the little LA looks gel. <laughs> I don't know. I'm doing, I don't even know what I look like. Like right here, I would. That's where the areas are. And I do my hair upside down most of the time too. Oh. So like, I would literally, probably, literally, probably. Help me, mother. So then you plop it. Yeah, that's perfect. That's like microfiber. Like upside down or? Mm -hmm. What do I do now? Now <laughs> is when I go in with the Denman and I'll like make it nice. How do you use the Denman? Cause I'm gonna use it how you I use it. I use it like, like this way and then Oh wait, do I? Then again, I just got the Denman last week and I don't know what I'm doing. We didn't use Miss Jessie's yet. On you? Yeah. One was... Oh. We did it? We did the conditioner. We did the spray. The leave-in. Oh. This. And I was thinking that this was going to be next. Oh. The pillow soft comes before the eco gel. This. It'll work out fine. Yeah, we'll do this. How yeah. much of this? I use a lot. Tell me when. I use a lot too, but you use so much other product that I don't... When? Okay. <laughs> make sure to get it like everywhere. Do you because... scrunch or no? No. Okay. No. My hair scrunches itself. It evenly distributes the product when you scrunch. No, I go in with a brush. Oh, this is when you do the Denman. Well, like, I'll go in with a brush, but I didn't bring one. I make sure to get like it really good in the, the perimeter, because that area gets really frizzy. That's how we There's do so it. There's so much stuff in my hair. Listen. That's what thick good and <laughs> I was going to say macaroni and cheese. Let me get okay. the back. So. Yeah. Like I make sure my hair looks pretty like almost straight when I'm brushing it and then I'll go in and add the definition with the Denman. Okay, so what do you do next? Diffuse? Okay, yeah. That's so it? Just, you always... use pillow soft and you diffuse? Yes, but I, I diffuse for a little bit and then I put some mousse. I scrunch, you said you don't scrunch, but like I would do it with this. Okay, so okay. I would be like. With the yeah, with the with the thing. There's the outlet. Should I use your you diffuser? Swap, yeah, Let's swap diffusers. Okay. But the thing is, I blow dry. I don't diffuse most of the time. I gotta I gotta blow dry. Sometimes though. I just smell it on the Diffusing takes a very long time. I know, but I've never not diffused. I've had this diffuser for like probably eight years. Yeah, I just got that and I paid way too much money for it. People are always like, oh, is it worth? I'm like, no, it's not worth it. Moroccan it's oil. Three hundred dollars. You can get one for like twenty dollars. That's my point. People see me use it and they're like, oh, I need to get that one, and I'm like, no, you don't. I'm I'm gonna start diffusing my hair with this. Mine's gonna take like four years because all this product you made me put in. It's gonna look good after it. Wait, and you do this on the cool setting? I do cool, warm, cool, warm. I do hot, full blast. You can do that. It's just not as good for your hair. Which way do you usually like your hair going? Maybe like this. I literally won't even touch my hair until it's like pretty dry. So you might as well get one of those blow dryers you could just sit in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, we have now spent literally an hour diffusing. <laughs> Diffusing our hair. I was like helping you diffuse. I have no idea what my hair looks like right now. You kind of looked in the phone. Yeah. Should we look at ourselves? Yeah. Oh, wait a second. I like it. I've never seen my roots this defined. My gosh. hair feels so moisturized. I probably need to start doing my hair like this. A little mousse. Sometimes I finish with what? Your hair's already. Yeah. I probably need mousse just to make it dry. She uses the John Frieda Luxurious Volume Perfectly Full Mousse. Curly hair routines swapped. What do you think of your hair? I like it. It just needs to dry. It's a little more flat than like how you usually wear it. But for me, like it works because my hair gets so big. So I have to flatten it out so it reaches like a middle ground. I feel like we still look pretty good. If I use as much leave-in conditioner as her, I'm gonna go broke. So I 
probably won't be using that much. Okay. Maybe I will start incorporating some leave-in. I think we've learned that even though we still look pretty good, there's a reason why everyone has their own curl routine. Don't just watch a YouTube video of someone else's curly routine. Go out and buy all the products and like expect it to work for you. It took years of like, just experimenting yeah. and then you just figure out what works for you and you keep it pushing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up if you like when we do curly hair videos. Go subscribe to Jenna's channel. Thanks. We filmed a video on her channel and she's awesome. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok. See you guys next week. Bye. Bye. La primera vez que te vi, supe que era la mujer para mí. Nunca tuve ni una duda, no. Y ahora vos tenés mi corazón. Dale, nena, contame lo que te gusta de mí. Dale, nena, mostrame lo que te hace feliz. Por fin.